Hello and welcome to this new video. It is a part of a list, so if you are new, please take a look to the previous videos because they are all connected. You will find the link on the description below. In this video, we will see how to connect the LED matrix 7219 to the Node MCU. As you can see, the wiring is very simple. In this example, I will connect the CS pin to D4. First, you need to add the library of the display. You will find it under the resources category in the site easycoding.tn. Now let's go to tune out for ESP8266. Make a zoom of 90% to view all of the blocks. Every time you use this display, you should call this init block only once in this setup part. In TuneYot, it supports only one display for the moment. Now I will try to display some different shapes. When you see the checked box, it means that the correspondent dot in the matrix will be switched on, otherwise it will be switched off. In the first block, I will switch on all the dots of the matrix. Next, I will try to modify that. Now we are ready to upload our program. And this is the result. Now I will make a program to scroll a text. First we need to call the init block. You can also change the intensity of the matrix lighting.
First, we should set the text to be displayed. You can also add a second line. In the loop part, we will need to ask the display to scroll the text, so you need to call these blocks in this order. You have to imagine that we are working on a buffer where there is a text, and the commit block will ask the matrix to execute the new scrolling of the text. Now I will execute the program and try to understand the result. So we have the scrolling of the first line hello world and notes that the program is scrolling in a loop the second text. Now imagine you have to change the text into the main loop. We will do that now. This part will scroll the text in the buffer 100 times. I chose randomly a big number just to see the behavior. After that, I will set a new text and I will scroll it uh, as well. Now you see this program, uh, you might think that scrolling of the text with the tuneot will be done only 100 times. In reality, it will be done 200 times because we have scrolling blocks in the beginning of the loop. Let's see now the result. I recommend uh, that you make uh, several tests to master the display. I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.